are. Well, hello. Thanks for meeting with me for this interview today. I have a few burning questions for you. Well, no problem, my dear. I'm always happy to meet with young, bright nurses who are interested in my theoretical research. So, Hildegard, why did you become a nurse? Well, in the 1930s, there were not many career options for a young woman in Pennsylvania, so I chose something to give me a little bit of freedom and to make my own choices. I had a very long career in nursing, you know, spanning many decades. Did you know that I was the first published nursing theorist since Florence Nightingale herself? And I did it without having a doctor as a co-author, which was quite scandalous at the time. Your theory was published in the 1940s. Why did you feel like a new theory about nursing practice was needed? I felt that medical care was based off of the patient and the nurse as separate entities with separate experiences. I began to understand that provi providing care to somebody is a shared experience between the nurse and the patient. I began to think of the nurse-patient relationship, as I'm sure you have heard of, is the cornerstone for understanding nursing practice, with both the patient and the nurse playing various different roles within a shared relationship. Here is my book, available at the UVic Library if you'd like to read it more thoroughly. Awesome. After such a long and illustrious career, what advice could you give nursing students in the application of your interpersonal theory? I believe that understanding the unique experiences of all allow for the nurse to bring forward knowledge and for the patient to bring forward knowledge. The nurse-patient relationship is one that does have a time limit, but much can be passed back and forth in the time that the relationship exists. I broke down the various roles and phases that the nurse and the patient relationship progresses through, and I know that parts of my theory have been heavily studied throughout the program at Camosa and Uvic, so you may already be incorporating my theory into your practice. Let's hope this presentation can further your learning. Thanks, Hildegard. Good luck, my dears.